This video shows you how to export a query to a spreadsheet. In task 2 in assignment um, 3, under part A, you need to export the output of a query to a spreadsheet. So in order to do that, what you have to do is, you have to go back to your database. So in order to export the output to a data, uh, spreadsheet, you must finish creating at least one query. So these are the queries in my database. So I'm going to export this query's output into a spreadsheet. First, I'm going to uh, open it. So that means if I go to back to the uh, design view, this query is the f all the female students who's doing course code CZ001. So if I go back to the data sheet too, I get only two female students. So I'm going to export this query into a um, spreadsheet. So what I have to do is I have to select the query, right click on it. And from these options, you have to select export. Since I want to export into Excel, I have to click Excel. So you can just export into a Word or any other formats that's shown in here. But in my case, I want to export to Excel. So I just click on Excel. And then from here, the file name, this is the place where I want to export it to. So I'm going to browse it and I'm going to select a folder that I'm going to export it to. So um, I'm going to select a folder called um, folder called um, export, right? And from save type as, you can change the format. It is 97 or 2007 or something like that. So I'm going to leave the default one and I click on save. Right? And then um, I have to tick this one export data with formatting and layout. Right? So that means it comes with the um, table uh, headers as well. And then I'm going to say OK. So uh, I don't want to uh, save the steps, so I just uh, press on close. So what I have to do is, in order to see the output, you have to go back to the folder that you saved um, the file, and then you can open the file. When you open the file, you can see the same data. So if I go back and uh, show you the um, query output, it gives me the same data.